Wow, the door opened before I even knocked. That's amazing. Welcome. So what is this room here? So for people who are first time cruisers, this is a balcony room, right? That is right. What do I need to know about this room? Is this a good room to book if you're a first time cruiser? You know, if you're a first time cruiser, I think this is a nice room. It is small, I'm not gonna lie. It's very narrow, but it's long and it's got a nice little balcony out there with a couple of chairs and a table. It's got ample room for two and a pull out couch. Um, I think it's, I think it's probably, plenty big enough for somebody who's just... You could just, probably sleep four in here. I think like you a probably couple could. It, yeah, you could. I don't know if I'd do it four adults, but probably, yeah. you know, a couple of kids would be great. Yeah. Um, there's pl we found that there's plenty of storage. You have to get that? <laughs> All right. What hey, else, we're on the ship. That's right. We've got Wi-Fi. You're getting phone calls. That's pretty cool. We've got Wi-Fi calling, yeah. right? Not That's so good. shabby. All right, so let's just start in the very front. You've got your door. You have to put your key in the slot in order to get the lights and the air conditioning to work. I think it's a great feature. You got a full length mirror over here, right? I mean, mm -hmm. everybody needs one of those. Yeah, man. And then in here you have, come on in. You have a little bathroom. It's got a full size tub, shower. It's got a sink. It's got a couple of shelves here. You can see we've got- Did you just our, fart or did you hit that spring? I did not. Thank you so <laughs> much. Oh, pretty cool. <laughs> that was a good one. That's so a 6.2. A couple of <laughs> shelves here. Okay, the nice thing about this bathroom is it's got Pump soap, oh, right? That's kind of cool. Okay, I'm gonna have to stop and take this. Hey, Felicia's back. What were you just doing? Did you just talk to somebody on the phone? I just took a FaceTime audio call on my phone over Wi-Fi calling. Was it FaceTime? It was FaceTime audio. Okay, so you on. have to have the streaming plus the, or internet plus streaming, right? Right. To do that, believe, okay, which is so. a few extra bucks. I believe so. That's pretty cool. You're able to connect right? uh, with the world while you're in the middle of the ocean. Right. I'm standing outside on the balcony talking to my daughter from Indiana. This is fantastic. We're back in the bathroom. Back in the bathroom. Wide angle. All right. All right. So this is a tub here. Yep. This is nice. This is an MSC ship. And MSC is kind of a, a late player. They're one of the biggest shipping, I think they are the biggest shipping company in the world. They've decided, hey, we can move freight all over the world really well, let's move people too. Right. You I have think, storage under here? So we have storage under here. This would be a trash can, mm -hmm. right, under here. And then over here you have a couple of shelves. Okay, nice. Okay. Nice. It's right. clever storage here. Yep. And Which I, I know some older Royal Caribbean and Carnival ships and their bathrooms are really, really tight. So this. This actually is really nice, this, smart use of space. It, it is, and um, on most cruise ships, they give you the little bars of soap you right. leave here. And yeah. personally, I'm not a fan of those. Yeah. But MSC has these pumps. Yeah, that's soaps. pretty cool. I didn't even pull out mine that I brought with me because this is perfect. It's nice. great. Water is instant hot. It's yep. wonderful. It's got a couple of shelves here, a couple of built-in glass cups for your toothbrush and your that's toothpaste. Nice. That's smart. Or whatever you want to use it for. And it lifts yeah. it off the uh, the, the table. It lifts it, it off the table. There. Yeah. Okay, cool. Yeah. So that's nice. Toilet that's nice has this weird flusher. Check this out. This is really weird. Some people say you can't sit on it, which is why this is here. You can't flush it while you're sitting on it because the pressure is so... you got to hear this. Listen, this is my favorite sound. It's crazy, <laughs> right? It's like suction. If you sit in there, probably suck your intestines out. Right. Um, you can't oh, put anything weird in the toilet, or you, you might can, get billed for right. it. So don't do wait, that. Back in the shower yeah. is the line that you could run across to this hang up. This is why your... you don't need magnets. Yeah. If you have wet bathing suits or towels, you can use this thing, and it does come out. If you don't need it, just flip it up like that, and well, it's supposed to pull back in. This one, there it is. So yeah, most cruise ships do have this, so you don't need those magnets if you need to hang wet bathing suits. That's exactly what's that for. And this way it'll drip right in the tub rather than on your carpet. That or hang up your wet towel after you're done shaking the shower. Right on. Right. And it's got a couple of hooks on the door here, which we have one of our hanging bags with our toiletries on it. Some people use shoe holders, shoe racks, or shoe bags for these things. There's just so much stuff. They do. And and we just, just found so that we, did, we didn't need it. We have we had those in the past, but we just found that we had enough space in this room, we didn't need one. Right on. So we talked about the mirror. This is a, mirror. what do they call this? This is a connecting room that's locked and has to be unlocked by the room attendants. Right. So we're not partnering with anybody yeah, here, so it is locked. there's another door on the other side of that, so you could put a couple of rooms together if you right. have a bunch of kids or whatever. We use this little corner here for our pop-up hamper mm -hmm. that nice. we brought with us. Smart. Right. And over here, let's go this way, I guess. Okay. We have from um, the top, yeah. A mini fridge. This is a mini bar, but it is a refrigerator, and you can. We've actually popped our own stuff in there. Then they do charge exorbitant fees 
for this liquor and soda in here so you don't just want to grab this willy-nilly but you can put your water in here and use the space that they're not using right. to keep things cold so that's really nice it's got a, a desk drawer here Mm -hmm. get your yeah, I have a whole bunch of sorry. things going on here. Right, so you've got a desk drawer here. It comes with a blow dryer that's already plugged in. That's cool. Right there, right? It worked pretty well. It works pretty well. I used it yesterday. Okay. It was fine. So you can store some stuff in here. Well, you did manage, they say nothing with heating elements on a cruise. Right, and you did manage to sneak in a blow dryer. Let's talk about that. No <laughs> sneaking. It was just like we did in our packing video. Yeah. It was right there. So I've got a brush blow dryer and... I've got my flat iron. Oh, and they look right through in right, your packed luggage? Right in my packed luggage. Okay. Wasn't trying to hide anything. It was right in there, broad daylight. Quite a collection of ducks. Quite a collection of pretty Smack little ducks. Smack one. Oh, look at you. All right, don't talk about those. We'll talk no, about those in another video. We've got a safe. Yeah. You it's put your passport and credit passport, cards, wallet, credit, whatever. Right, exactly. One, two, three shelves. Two drawers right here. The bottom's a fakie. The bottom is a fakie. And then on the other side is room for your hanging clothes. So you can put dresses, suits, yeah, tuxedos, whatever right? you want to do. It's got, we've got two backpacks, room for shoes on one side, and we're all put away. Yeah, we're not tripping over smart, anything. Smart use of space okay. in here. Now we normally book suites, but we wanted to show we want to show everyone what an inside or balcony room would exactly. look like. The inside room is going to be probably the same as this, but without the balcony, yep, about yep. the same amount of Absolutely. space. Absolutely. All right, we talked about the pullout. How the about the bed? The, I found the bed to be very comfortable. Now, it is a king, and it is actually two twins pushed two together. Two twins pushed together. So there is a seam in the middle, right. but you really can't feel it unless you're looking for it. Correct. And then under the bed, that's where you have your luggage storage. Mm -hmm. So you use all your, kinds of stuff Use that. your space wisely. Yeah. Don't leave anything out to you you have to trip over. Smart. It's got a couple little tiny um, narrow nightstands with two cubbies, mm -hmm. so you can store stuff in there as well yeah. on either side of the bed. Right. The lighting is wonderful. You can turn off all the lights in the room with the switches on the side of the bed. Cool. It's got little night lights. If you wanted to stay up and read or work on your phone or your computer, whatever the case may be, you can turn on just your little personal light there, Cool. which is great. Room darkening curtains. Room darkening curtain, curtains, which are great. And then you a balcony. You sleep in the middle of the day. You wouldn't, even, you wouldn't even know it's day. This is your balcony. This is a small balcony, but big enough. Couple this of chairs. This is a small balcony. It's got a couple of chairs, a footstool, and you can sit out here and enjoy your morning coffee or mid afternoon sun, take a rest. Whatever the rainbow the case may this be. morning. Rainbow was gorgeous, wasn't it? Yeah, very, very nice. So we are currently docked at um, MSC's Ocean K Ocean Private K, Island, yeah. and we're not on the side where you see the island, so we're sitting here with a view of the ocean, which just is perfect. It's a quaint little room, and uh, MSC has some really good deals on cruises. People thought Carnival was the cheapest, but this was actually cheaper than a Carnival four-day cruise. Right. I feel like we have plenty of room in this room for the two of us. There is nothing in the way. We're not tripping over anything. You do have your laptop and your recording I have equipment. a little recording studio in right, here now. Right, because you actually had to do a couple of recordings for some clients I have while to we do one here. right now. Um, and it's worked out great. There's a nice little TV. It's on a little swivel. Um, this will tell you where you are in right. the uh, sunset. I think it gives you some weather too, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. And yeah. I do like these two little pocket shelves here. Yeah. A storage space for your remote control. But now, all ships are not the same. All ships are not the same. This particular one on MSC Seaside is room 15127, and it's working out perfectly for us. Let's call guest services and see what happens. <laughs> Good afternoon. Can we just leave from the guest services? How may I assist you? Hi, I just wanted to say hi, and you're doing a great job. Thank you, sir. Okay, bye. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so there it is. Yeah, they all have these phones. You could call um, You could call home on these things. Can't you could. That's pretty expensive. And I do want to note that the walls are magnetic. You have do you do have some hooks there just to prove that they oh, are magnetic. Oh, I'm doing a video that these hooks actually suck. Now, I have the most powerful ones you can get. I bought the most extensive, powerful suction earth magnet. They're, I mean, it's a hard time coming off, but I'll show you that they're completely useless. I have these things up here as a joke, and there's a separate video why you really don't need these for anything. All right. All right. I like it. Good work. Thank you. Hey, hit that like, subscribe, and share, too, and comment if you have any questions. We're happy to answer those to the best of our ability. Thanks for watching. Bye, Felicia. I knew she was going to say that. <laughs> I knew it. I'm not leaving my wingman. My long-lost cousin, Tim Cruz, is the ultimate reviewer. Woo! <laughs> Please watch Cruz Reviews with Tim Cruz. Now, Tim feels the need. The need for speed! <laughs> well, not so much speed, we're on a cruise, but he completes me. Cruise reviews, there is no substitute.
Look at all this. They're just people just standing there waiting to throw champagne at you. And if you don't have champagne in your hands, you are in trouble right now. I'm telling you, this is the most important meeting I have ever seen on a cruise ship. Mm -hmm.